first glance, this might look like any other classic car, but it's taken one careful owner two years to build. It has everything any other car would generally have, except would you believe it, it's made of mahogany. Former cabinet maker Mike Morris decided to build it after seeing something similar as a teenager, and now it's his pride and joy. It's just a personal thing. I just wanted to see if I could do it, that was all. Not for any profit or particular reason. Based on a Triumph Herald, the metal subframe is original, but everything else has been stripped down and rebuilt. Held together by thousands of wooden pins, it's just past its MOT. I think it's absolutely fabulous. Absolutely. The workmanship's unbelievable. It's fantastic craftsmanship. A real, real a work of art. The finish is absolutely out of this world. Personally, I think it's worth it because I've set out, I've achieved what I set out to achieve and that's what I wanted. It's a one-off. There's nothing else like it. Um, but now it's in the way and it's got to go. <laughs> Not satisfied with his car, Mike's branching out and plans to build an entire truck out of timber something he's been pining for since he finished the Triumph. But don't sit there and willow in self-pity at not owning a masterpiece like this. Mike plans to sell it to fund his next venture. Hello. Mark Tattersall, Granada Reports, Thornton Cleveleys.